Nature must have had a lot of time on her hands when creating all the different plant and animal species. Because there are around 8.7 million species of animals and 391,000 different plant species, it's believed it would have taken 1,000 years to document every single animal and the vast majority of them have not been identified. Today, we have a look at some of the most fascinating animals on Earth. Number 27, Pretty in Pink. This is by far the prettiest armadillo around, and it's called the Pink Fairy Armadillo. Sadly, like many unusual animals, they are a threatened species. They're usually found on sandy plains, dunes, and the grassy areas of Argentina. They're nocturnal and eat insects and plants. Number 26, Cuteness Overload. It's a shame you have to head down to the depths of the ocean to spot this little guy, the Dumbo Octopus. He's by far the most adorable creature you'll ever find at those extreme depths. He uses those ears to swim and has the ability to swallow his victims, I mean, prey, whole. He isn't very big though, so don't worry. Number 25, all the better to eat you with, my dear. This is the tufted deer, and you'll find them in central China. They have a tuft of dark fur on their foreheads and sport these really large fangs. They use these teeth to fight other males, whereas other deers would use antlers. Number 24, paint the town red. The red panda is certainly an intriguing looking creature with its red, black, and white body. They're from southwestern China in the Himalayas and are often called the shining cat. They mainly eat bamboo, but will also eat other offerings nature can provide. They're a distant cousin of the giant panda, and sadly, there are only around 10,000 left in the world. They lead pretty solitary lives, and females have between one and four cubs at a time. Number 23, Kung Fu Fighting. This insane looking slug was recently discovered in Sabah, Malaysia. They received the name Borneo Hills Ninja Slug, and the reason they're called Ninja Slugs is because they're able to shoot chuck like darts to a potential mate, which gets them in the mood. They're actually a semi slug, as their shell is too small to retract into. Number 22, He's a Looker. This is the Venezuelan poodle moth, and this moth was only discovered in 2009 by Arthur Anker. He looks incredibly soft and cuddly, but don't be fooled. Like most animals, their hair is there to protect them. If you were to get these hairs in your skin, they would irritate your skin immensely. Many believed this moth to be a hoax, but that has obviously been proven false. Number 21, Horsing Around. This really unusual looking critter is called a horsehead grasshopper, and they're native to Peru. They look very similar to stick insects, except for their very horse-like features and the fact that they're related to grasshoppers. The females are larger than the males, and their long back legs enable them to spring 20 times their body length. Number 20, Cat in the Hat. This unusual looking cat-like creature is called a fossa, and they are found in Madagascar. They share many similar traits to cats, but they're closely related to the mongoose. They love to eat lemurs. In fact, 50% of their diet is lemurs alone. Bizarrely, their scientific name means hidden anus, as there's a pouch on the animal that hides its anus. Number 19, what's in a name? If you're a cockapoo, then everything. Just saying this parrot's name is fun, but sadly we may only be saying it in memory if we're not too careful. The cockapoo is the world's largest parrot and there are only 154 left in the world. They're found in New Zealand and the few surviving ones are kept on predator-free islands. They apparently smell very odd and bark like a dog. They're quite portly for a parrot and are nocturnal. They're also known as owl parrots and were discovered in 1845 by George Robert Gray. Number 18, Angels of the Ocean. This is an Irrawaddy dolphin, and the only place you'll find this unusual looking dolphin is in the Bay of Bengal in Southeast Asia. They're closely related to the killer whale, and the earliest recording sighting of one was in 1866. Not too much is known about these dolphins, as it's not often you spot them surfacing, but it's believed there are not too many of them left. Number 17, Who Wants to Live Forever? Clearly, the Teratopsis nutricula does. This crazy jellyfish is pretty much immortal. This is how it works. The jellyfish is able to revert back to the immature pulp stage once it has reached sexual maturity, and then it basically starts the whole process again. They can do this forever, but it doesn't make them immune to predators, particularly in the polyp stage where they're physically unable to move. Number 16, King of Chickens. Bow down to the onagadori, which is Japanese for honorable fowl. This is practically the king of chickens, and it was during the 1600s that selective breeding took place, and this majestic chicken graced the world. The tail feathers never stop growing, and some have reached lengths of 27 feet. Stories prevail as to how the soldiers used the feathers in their helmets and spears, and that farmers who raised these chickens didn't have to pay taxes. 
Number 15, Slow and Easy. Why haven't we seen a movie featuring this adorable slow loris yet? This nocturnal creature is from Southeast Asia, but don't let those cute looks fool you. This loris has toxin in its teeth, making them rather venomous. It also protects their babies, which are licked during grooming and cleaning by their parents. They like to be alone and spend a lot of time foraging. If a predator is close by, they can also freeze and remain completely still for as long as they need before the predator goes away. Number 14, ready for battle. In the Amur River in Russia, this incredible turtle looks much like a dinosaur. It's been identified as an alligator snapping turtle, officially the heaviest freshwater turtle in the world. It's not known how it landed up in Russian waters, as they're usually found in United States waters. These guys can weigh up to 220 pounds, and their shells can grow to 26 inches long. Number 13, reveal yourself. Is it a raccoon or is it a dog? What do you think? This is a raccoon dog, also known as tanuki. From East Asia, these unusual looking animals date back millions of years. They are wild animals and not domesticated. They don't bark, and you might have seen one featured in Super Mario Bros. 3. Number 12, all the better to hear you with. This is a long-eared jerboa, and these little creatures are found in China and Mongolia. The giant ears help to keep these nocturnal creatures cool, and they can jump up to 9.8 feet. Interestingly, this animal was Britain's World War II mascot. Number 11, mistaken identity. It's crazy how sweet, yet dangerous, this lowland streaked tenrec actually looks. It appears as a combination between a bee and a mouse. They're found in Madagascar, and they use stridulation to communicate. Stridulation is when animals rub certain parts of their body together to generate sound. Number 10, sparkle on. Leave it to nature to show off the best of the best when it comes to sparkling. This is the glowing sea turtle, and it was discovered by divers in the Solomon Islands. There are many awesome animals that are bioluminescent, but this one is the only one that we know of that glows. It was documented that the shell glowed red and green, and that they might use it to communicate with one another. Number nine, it's the little things. And you can't get littler than an axolotl. These enchanting little creatures are a species of the Mexican mole salamander. The white ones are actually quite rare and you usually find them in black or greenish brown. Wild ones are only found in one place in the entire world, lakes and canals of Mexico. These chaps are often studied as they have self-regenerating abilities. Number eight, the nose knows. This is a critically endangered antelope called a saiga. They're only found in Kazakhstan and Mongolia, although they used to be plentiful in the Eurasian steppe zone. That large nose has the ability to warm up the freezing air before it reaches the saiga's lungs. Number seven, pucker up. This is a fish with human lips, and it's the Malawi blue dolphin. It's not a dolphin, as you can see, but is rather an exotic cichlid found in Lake Malawi in Africa. They live for up to 10 years and grow to be around 10 inches. They're pretty popular in in-home aquariums, but note that the males get aggressive with other males. So team one male up with a few females. Number six, I see through you. There have been a few spectacular see-through animals that have come to light lately, and this particular glass frog was found in Costa Rica in 1973. It's Diane's bare-hearted glass frog, and if you place them on a piece of glass, you can see the frog's internal organs. If you view this little frog from the top, it looks a lot like Kermit the Frog from the Muppets. Number five, don't worry, the spider is smaller than you. Regardless, if we came upon the long-horned orb weaver spider, we'd be pretty scared. This spider has eight eyes and two spiky horns protruding from its body. These guys were discovered in the 1700s in Asia, and fortunately for you and me, they're really into their insects, and that's about it. Number four, something's missing. This is a pretty unusual looking kind of chicken known as the naked neck. We don't really need to elaborate there. It's pretty self-explanatory. They are originally from Transylvania and were largely developed in Germany thereafter. It's apparently very common in Europe, but you hardly ever see them in North America. Number three, going down. The ocean has so many unusual and intriguing creatures, and these are most certainly high on that list. They're called sea angels, and they're truly beautiful. They are translucent, and their insides are bright orange. They're actually slugs, and apparently the awesome orange bits are their testicles. They're found in Japanese waters, and they grow tentacles from their face, which they use to devour their prey. Number two, that sucks. This is a lamprey, and these bizarre creatures are jawless fish with around 38 different varieties. You usually find them in cooler, coastal, and fresh waters. 18 of these lampreys are parasitic, which means they will suck the blood and fluids from other fish. They don't usually kill them, though, if that reassures you at least a little bit. These ancient fish were used for medicinal purposes, and they're thought to be around 450 million years old. 
Number one, little cross-eyed. This is the cross-eyed plant hopper, and this comical looking creature is native to Southwest US and Mexico. We don't know too much about him. In fact, we know almost nothing. There is no theory that completely explains why this bug has these tiny little crossed eyes, but perhaps you guys can fill us in. 